This training DVD is the second in a two-part series produced by the Fredericton Aikido Dojo, located in Fredericton, New Brunswick, Canada. Use it as a guide to your training in Aikido. Now we'll be doing the, uh, the Yokoman uh, strike and the Yokoman reverse. The Yokoman starts the same as the Shoman. You bring both hands up into the air, and as you come down, you strike to the side in a diagonal form, okay? Bring it straight up, pierce the, uh, the sky with your fingers, and cut. Cutting with the, uh, the edge of the hand, okay? This part here, which is called the knife edge of the hand. So one, use both hands. Notice how the uh, back foot moves away out of the line of a possible counterattack. Okay? Up and strike. Okay? Now for the reverse yokeman, we bring the hand up again. Instead of cutting this way here in this direction, we cut in the other direction. Okay? Bring the hand up and cut. Bring it up and cut in the other direction, bringing the other hand into the solar plexus, just right under, right under the solar plexus. Once again, you're cutting with a knife edge, and the other knife edge comes into the solar plexus, okay? And one, and change, two, change, three, change, four, change, five, okay? That's the reverse open. And if you're coming in on a strike, Okay, you can shuffle in, as we did with the uh, ordinary opening. Other side. Okay, now those are the two strikes we'll be uh, concentrating on for this particular level, okay? Next we'll do the uh, front roll uh, with uh, my three students here. And we'll be doing the front roll, but I'll be throwing them uh, please, can you stand up over here, the line? We've learned how to front roll and back roll on our own. Now we're going to start practicing being thrown by someone else, okay? So I get down on my knees, and my partners come in and grab one hand and the other. Okay? It's a poking throw. And I do this to help them learn how to be thrown, okay? It's quite different than going on your own. You must take the responsibility of your own falls, okay? So step forward with the outside leg, extend your arm, and roll. Just walk straight through without stopping. With normal speed. Good. Help oh, that's good. Thank you. Now we'll go on to some movement exercises. Uh, four corners exercise, okay? The four corners exercise uses the Yurimi movement and the Pinti movement, okay? We combine those two movements with the medium guard. One, move forward, we pivot. Two, now we move to the side, bringing the back foot forward up to the heel, and then out again. Three, and then we pivot again, and four. So voila, the four corners move, okay? Let me try it again here, just concentrating on the feet. One, shuffle, shuffle, pivot. Two, shuffle, shuffle. Bring in the foot up, and then out for three, and pivot, four. Then we start over, okay? Let's try it again. One. Bring my hands to the side. Two. Good extension. Three. And four. And one. And two. And three. And four. Now, somebody will help me do a forms exercise, okay? On ski. He's going to strike with it instead of 
as we did before coming in on the urine, he's going to step in and strike with his teeth or strike to the abdomen. Good. Okay. My first movement is an eerie beam. Okay. I'm shuffling with him. Which means that the arm is not crossed. 
it's on the same side. Okay? So we're going to do ikkyo. Basically, we go under, under, grab the hand here. There we go. The same pin as before on the previous video. Okay? Back here. He grabs the hand. Okay? I go under his hand by dropping my center, okay? Bringing the hand here, it's almost as if I wanted to bring my hand around and to strike him on the head. I bring my hand around, like here, bringing the hand up where I can grab it, okay? Then the hand that he had in his moves down towards the elbow, okay? I extend and walk up. Okay. Oh. 
You can go into a, a back brake fall for now. See, as I go back and down, okay? It comes in, step back, and then, okay? Into the wall place. He grabs here. I step back into a pin sheet. At the same time, I bring my arm up under the elbow and pull down, just slightly. Pull down, step back, and you get a hand up, striking towards the face. Then I turn the hips and strike down. One more, take a tip from this side. Here, bring the hand up immediately. Step back, bring the other hand up, add the meat to the face. As you turn the hips, cut down. One, and, and later on, please, yeah. later on you can roll, or break it. Okay? Hip. So that was a coqueue throw, a breath throw, on a grab to the shoulder. Using a foot movement, which we all should know by now, which is the pinchy, going in towards the inside of the body, not the outside. Okay? Outside provides other, uh, other possibilities. Now we'll do uh, two other uh, techniques on one on Yokeman, Yurimi, done in three different ways. Strike to the side of the head, okay? I want to do Yurimi Nage, so I'll step in two. Bring my hands up as if I want to strike and shoulder. Turn, strike him straight on, okay? And then One version of your me. Put down in the air. Then Okay, 
very natural movement for the reverse stroke movement. Try it a few more times. Instead of striking this side, it's going to strike to the other side. Relax, great. Slide the hand down once again on the arm. Sorry, on the uh, leg. There we go. And one more. And reverse will come in. Deep job. Keep the arm up a bit higher than the elbow. As you can. We're going to start with the uh, uh, rolling break fall. And like uh, Sean, you go the other to move back a bit. Over here. Start. Then he's going to do the normal front roll and end off in a break fall. Go ahead. Now notice where the legs are. Okay, one leg straight out. This hand hitting. This leg slightly bent. Okay. Now from this point, he sits up straight, brings the knee down, turns around so he faces me into a, a, a medium guard. Okay. Let's try it again. Go ahead. Sits up. Good. And one more time. Knee down. In the close to the wall place. And that's nice and slow. One more time. Good. Good. Okay. So yeah, please. Now we're going to do, we're going to demonstrate a series of grabs you can have. Okay? I can grab the here on medium, medium grabbers. I can grab the wrist, one wrist only. Okay? This is called Katatatori. Katatatori. I can grab with both hands, but to do that I come up with the other and grab. This is called more rotatory. Okay? I can grab both hands, rotatory, or I can grab the cross arm, which has the same name, so we have to change guards here. The same name as, as, uh, as the uh, other one we showed previously, but it's in a different stance. Okay? Now I can grab, sorry, the shoulder, katatori, okay? Or I can grab both. Real cutatory. I can also grab the lapel. Okay? And I can do from this the grab and strikes. Okay? Or grab the wrist and strike. Okay? Or also basically I can grab front kick. Okay? Or grab here at a knee. Knee to the midsection. Okay? From the back, I can grab both wrists, one wrist with the choke hold, okay. or shoulders from the back, or just with the one hand and strike. Okay? Now, I can also grab in this fashion here, low or high. Okay? Or even just the elbows. Somebody's going to strike me stepping in, striking with the uh, yokeman, ordinary yokeman, not the reverse. And I'll be doing an irimi movement, a double ten can and then a ten chi. And in, irimi.
uh, terminates the movement exercises. Now we're going to work with uh, Rob on, once again, on Rio Tatatori. Okay. We're going to do Shonage using tension movement towards the inside. is the one I step back with, okay? Keeping the hand physically at mid-level, okay? Grabbing with the other, so that once I finish grabbing, my thumbs are pointing in opposite directions. Turn the hips, uplift my partner a bit, using a bit of a pin in the air, going through and in a regular fashion. Okay, so one, two, Thank 
yellow. Okay? You can step in if you wish. You can go straight in. Or once you grab, you can change.
with just the one grab to the shoulder. Okay. Okay. Grab, turn. Okay. And you will with your work. As you go back, grab. Turn, 
Thank you. 